I'm works for you, Chief Meteorologist Dan Threlkeld. Temperatures climbed up into the mid 30s. That was it. Those were the high temperatures that we had on Tuesday. Wednesday will be warmer. The temperature in the evening had already fallen down to 28 degrees, and that was the temperature that we had just before 9 o'clock in the evening. Now, we had a little bit in the way of some light snow early Tuesday morning in southeast Oklahoma. Then we were teased with what looked like was snow along I-44. None of it reached the ground. Overnight, the skies should clear off, and that'll set us up for a very cold start. If you're going to be out early Wednesday morning, you need the hat, you need the gloves, and that big coat. It will be very cold out there. For the afternoon, we'll see some high clouds move in. There's actually a wind shift line that will shift those southerly winds back around to the north by Wednesday evening, and that means Thursday's not going to warm up a lot. Still, we're looking at temperatures warmer than what we saw Monday and Tuesday. So how cold are we talking about? Well, the temperature in Tulsa down to 19, the surrounding suburbs out towards Jinx and Broken Arrow, 17, maybe 18. That's a cold start. Bartlesville at 14. Temperature in McAllister at 18 degrees, and the highs will be in the mid to upper 40s. So our temperature close to average for this time of year. Coffeyville will make 46 degrees. And the seven day forecast shows that nice steady warm up on Friday, 55. Look at Saturday. How about that? 58. Then on Sunday, wind shift to the north and some cooler air begins to move in. The coldest air will be felt on Monday and Tuesday when highs will only be in the 30s.